In 1950, the ukulele, the pickleball of stringed instruments, arrived at the 1950 World's Fair and was seen by the Tin Pan Alley publishers there and their vaudeville performers. And they just got super excited because they thought, this is it. This is how we're going to push our songs out across America. And sure enough, when they got back to New York, that's exactly what they did. Our grandmother, Lola Sedgwick, as a co-ed at University of Utah, a flower co-ed at University of Utah, picked up that instrument and never set it down. And you can imagine all the good times they had seeing songs around campfires, around who knows what, some of which were passed on to us because they're appropriate and singable today, and many of which are not, which have been excised from the, uh, well, let's say we only see those behind closed doors. Then, the, and it was a wild, popular instrument in the 20s. Then again in the 50s, when, when the soldiers came back from Hawaii, they brought with them these ukuleles they picked up there. And our mother, Lola, the daughter of Lola, Claudia, who's here with us, said, you know what, in fact, Mom, why don't you come over and do this with us? <laughs> Shine on, shine on, harvest moon. 
Shine on, shine.